What is going on, everybody? It is me, your boy, Perucho. We are back with another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan battle video. Today's Dragon Ball Z Dokkan battle. We're back with another, what's I'm gonna call it? Uh, Dokkan All Stars raid, dude, which, you know, you know the. Bruh. <laughs> We literally had like a good freaking what's gonna call it uh, line of STR rainbow uh, key spheres that we could have used for the GT build. But whatever, you know what? It is what it is. But anyways, guys, the most important thing of any of my freaking videos, of course, is you guys. How are you guys doing? Hopefully, all you guys are doing fan freaking fantastic, dude. But I think by the time this video is going up, they're probably uh, saying they already passed by. Dude, one thing I wanted to mention definitely for sure is like, dude, I cannot believe that uh, what's gonna call it uh, the super easy A was coming to global dude like out of nowhere like i logged into my or i actually know i think it was like during the daily reset i looked that there was new info uh, up available and then i'm like what the hell what info do we have available and then it's like dude the uh, extreme easy a i'm like dude extreme easy a or, or extreme uh, z awakening uh, super extreme z awakening uh, coming to global and i'm like dude what the hell dude uh, i didn't I, I mean i'm not caught up with like i i um i think it was announced obviously first at jp that it was going to get that and it was announced during after the um, anniversary celebration and you know, for the longest, I'm like, all right, dude, when are they going to drop, like, the info and, you know, the Dragon uh, Super Saiyan 3 Goku Dokkan Festival, AGL in particular, uh, info, so we can, like, you know, see what we're, what we're you know, what we're going to be using or what we're up against, or not what we're up against, but you know what I mean, like, um, what info we're getting and I guess how difficult it might be. Uh, I don't know. We'll get the numbers for that. But anyways, yeah, dude, uh, info dropped on Global and I'm like, dude, wow, <laughs> this is crazy that we're going to be getting this. So, yeah. This, uh, just seeing that, the, uh, I'm like, dude, the sync is, is it actually happening, huh? We're trying to get both global and the Japanese version of Dokkan uh, battle, like, together synced up, huh? It's, it's, <laughs> it was something that I never imagined. I mean, obviously, it would have, if it did happen, it was going to be one of the greatest outcomes for the game itself. But, like, I never thought it would have been this close, dude. I thought it would have been, like, another year or two until that uh, actually happened, right? But, yeah, uh, literally, we just have to wait till this summer, and then, boom, we're both synced up. I mean, the only thing, obviously, that will be missing... Which is like I said this before, is the what's it called? I guess the uh, the foresight. Uh, I, yeah, the foresight of just like being able to see like what's gonna be releasing one or what we should save up our stones. Even though like you know the hype level was probably not the same as when the JP gets the units first and whatnot, but still like just being able to see like what uh, we should like save our stones and, and yada 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 was such a great feeling. But I mean, I'd rather take being synced up with J uh, the Japanese version of the game any time of the day than freaking what's it called being behind and you know getting the content. Like, but yeah, um, anyways, uh, that's one thing I wanted to mention for sure. Though, like my surprise of being freaking, I've seen the Extreme Z Awakening on the info data page when I was actually going on my walk, too, honestly. I was like, dude, what the hell? It's coming to freaking global. It's freaking crazy, dude. Uh, but anyways, uh, I wanted to uh, come over here on uh, this Dokkan All-Star Radio video. I don't know if this video, uh, it should probably release either before, like a little before or during the time. I'm at this convention already, but guys, I'm going again to freaking PAX East, dude. Uh, I am quite uh, not surprised, I would say, that I'm going there again, but uh, I'm going there with a different third. So it's a third uh, three party three party group that we're going again. It's just me and my two other friends. Um, just one of them being different. Uh, initially, funny enough, that one friend, he was supposed to go last year, but then I, I forgot something. Oh, he had a different, he had a completely different job before, and that job screwed him over to not go to freaking what's we call it, PAX East. So he was sadly not able to go last year, which kind of sucked, but then, uh, whatever, it doesn't really matter. Now that he got a new job, and he has submitted, like, his PTO time to be able to be, you know, saying that he's not going to be available during that time, and just coming to PAX East with us is finally, it's, it's dope, dude. It's, and then also, too, since uh, last year, I mean, last year was pretty nice and all, uh, for it being, like, I guess, my second PAX that I've been ever since, like, the first time was, like, probably, like, 10 years ago at that point, or 10 plus years since I went there with my mother. Uh, like quite a while ago. I, I don't recall that I was in high school or something, or maybe middle school. Anyways, I went there a while ago, and dude, I always remember. I think my mom, or it probably is it, no, it's probably still like on my Facebook or something that I have like the freaking Take Care Drake shirt or something. And I'm smiling, dude. It was like freaking four in the morning or something like that, where we were supposed to catch it because we went there on a for a Saturday thing, and then we went there and then we got back that that day up to dude. It was like it was for crazy, but. Uh, thankfully, my mom was willing to do that for me, uh, and yeah, like I experienced PAX during that time, and I feel like the, the goodies that they gave out too during that year was pretty darn good. Uh, I think it's not going to be comparable to that like ever again, but yeah. Anyways, uh, going to PAX again, dude. Uh, this time, I feel like we're a little more prepared. Like, uh, I feel like <laughs> I'm the one that's trying to be preparing the group for anything. Uh, one thing's for sure is that uh, last year, we went to a hotel that served both, uh, what's I'm going to call it? Uh, well, not both. They served breakfast early. 
And yeah, that, that's, that's the one thing that kind of sucks is we're not going to have like free breakfast or unlimited uh, breakfast buffet, which I mean, there's also advantage to it because uh, last year, since, you know, that was a thing, they were only serving this uh, breakfast buffet at a certain time. So me and my friends that went last year, we had to wake up a certain time to be able to get the buffet, of course, because we definitely didn't want to miss that. So uh, we'll go there, garage and whatnot, and, you know, shower, yeah, yeah, be ready. And, you know, uh, but this time, I mean, Although it sucks that we're not getting the free breakfast, but we could wake up, I guess, essentially whatever time we want, we want to, because we're not restricted to, you know, eating breakfast or eating anything at all at a certain time. Right. And, but yeah, uh, we're going to be doing groceries actually, but that, uh, when we, uh, what's we call it, go there to, uh, Boston and, you know, be prepared. Uh, see, I mean, I don't even know like our hotel, I mean, our hotel room, we did get it at a nice pr uh, price and we are at, like at a nice location. I would say too, I guess, uh, we're like really close by to the convention. And yeah, it's just like, are we gonna have like a, uh, cause it's kind of, it's kind of condensed, uh, I would say, uh, it's condensed the right word, or I guess compress the room to try to like, uh, uh, what's the, oh my God, what's the word? It's not like, it's not like simplify or anything like that, but it's just trying to, I guess, um, use, uh, make it look spacious, I guess, but like, you know, it's still kind of a small room, but anyways, yeah, that's that. Uh, it's going to be fun doing groceries with my friends. Cause I, I don't think I've, I think the only time I've ever done groceries with them is this one time where. Um, me and actually my group of friends, actually, uh, me and my group of high school friends, we went to freaking, uh, what's it called? A diner to go eat breakfast and whatnot. We were like catching up and one I think that was literally two after, uh, we came back from PAX East. So we caught up and yada yada. And then I told my best friend, I'm like, dude, can we, <laughs> dude, can we go <laughs> to Sam's club? I need to get some, um, you know, some water and whatnot. He's like, yeah, sure. You know, whatever. And then the whole squad were down. So it was, uh, it was two, we, we went there with two cars. Oh my God. I mean, I didn't even just off. Probably not, unless these guys just started doing crit, then maybe. But anyways, yeah, we went to freaking Sam's Club, dude. <laughs> and I needed to get, I think during that time, I didn't, uh, I wasn't drinking like filtered water. So, uh, you know, I was just drinking a bottle of water. So, like, I think uh, I, I brought to my friend's car, like, I think it was four or five packs of bottle, water bottle packs. He's like, dude, what happened to just a few things, dude? Um, I think I got that. I think I got, like, some protein stuff. He's like, dude, what? You just did, you did, like, a whole grocery. I, I feel like I got a couple of other things, but I don't remember what. And I just started laughing my butt off, dude, because, dude, the, this car was, like, it, like... <laughs> <laughs> my best friend's car like freaking flattened a bit because of like the weight that was like being put on no no what what okay i can't be i cannot be put the blame all on me because dude initially we were going to sam's club right for me because i wanted to get some stuff but then since i have the freaking membership my other friends are like oh let's get this oh let, let me get let can you uh, spot me for this and then dude essentially it turned out to be like the, uh, two other people that wanted to get stuff too for sam's club so they could take it to their house and i'm like dude oh my freaking god dude so they they cannot blame the weight of the car suffering because of me dude uh that is not my fault uh, i i tried to keep it at a minimal which i mean i, I kind of I, I i i don't know i have to ask my my friend again like i'm like was it like a little bit I, i'm not too sure but anyways disregarding that dude um paxis yeah we're buying groceries and it should be fun honestly because like you know we're a bunch of like clowns and whatnot so we'll definitely be goofing around a lot whatnot. and also we are going to like a few parties that are planned uh, for PAX East, so I'm looking forward to that as well, dude. Um, definitely for sure, because last time we wanted to like go out and like, you know, I guess be social, yada, yada, yada. You know, since we're uh, we're not obviously from Boston, so we definitely want to like, you know, check out what's around the area, what, what is there to offer. So uh, there are a few parties that we are like, you know, we have to, um, I guess, reserve. Of course, def that's definitely going to be a good time for sure, like meeting people and whatnot, man. That's always a good time. I always love meeting new people because like, you know, you just get to know, I guess, who they are and, you know, you, God knows what kind of stories uh, they have or what things they've been through. Hopefully not bad things, of course, obviously. But yeah, um, just meeting people is dope, honestly. And yeah, thankfully we have like a party, I think, uh, or we have two events that we've reserved to go to, which is uh, one for Friday night and one for Saturday night. So back to back. So Friday uh, will be like a probably like a chill day. We'll probably, you know, just go maybe to a bar or something to get some drinks and then, you know, just go back to the hotel and chillax there and maybe buy like our own bottle of drinks from a liquor store or something. And then from there, uh, we'll probably, uh, I'm not trying to promote alcohol. No, 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 no. Uh, don't take that. I'm just, I'm just staining my plans. So I'm going to be doing, uh, what should I do this? Yes. I'm probably going to do that. And then let's do this with the Bulma. And then we could give you all of those. So you, yeah, you should be able to get 24 keys right there, or 24 keys, uh, super attack. But anyways, yeah. Uh, go back Friday should be chill and then Saturday and well actually no uh, Thursday 
is where we actually what I described like as the plan for Friday, and then Friday is, and Saturday is where we're gonna be what's we call uh, you know, woo, like party, yeah, 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 woo, good time. Um, I, I guess like talking and yada, yeah, yeah, meeting new people, and whatnot, and then Sunday. We're just gonna chillax there. We're gonna, uh, you know, just take it slowly. And then I think obviously it's the last day of PAX, so we'll I guess try whatever things we want to try for that day. And then the following day, sadly, is the you know <laughs> the return of going back home. And yeah, that's about it, honestly. That's the the plan for right now in PAX East. Um, I mean, there are some food places that I want to go to because I remember, um, last year, uh, I wanted to like go to like an Asian restaurant, some some sort of like a you know buffet place. To you know, to go eat because you know, uh, um, food can be quite expensive when you're in an like, expensive area. So one of my other uh, friends are recommending uh, us to eat at a uh, Chinatown that was nearby there. And we're like, oh, okay, yeah, sure, let's freaking go there. And thankfully, it wasn't that far of a walk, but it was like freaking uh, thirty, uh, not thirty, like twenty minutes or something like that. And I'm pretty sure because our uh, walking, our walking pace wasn't too bad at all. So yeah went through that and then it was like i think a k-pot or something like that. it was pretty darn good honestly but uh, i still cannot find like a korean barbecue spot nearby the area where freaking the convention is i mean not nearby but like you know somewhere that's not isn't too far either i'd say like an hour or two hours something like that with like public transportation or like walking or anything like that but yeah also another beneficial thing uh for our trip here too is that last year uh we had to take a bus to be able to i mean the the there was a free shuttle bus for like our hotel that we stood in last time that would take us to like you know the, the convention center for free or not like on it but like at least nearby it and dude <laughs> uh, that, that that's one of the things that kind of sucked is like we had to come back home not by like a, i wouldn't say like we had to come back home by a certain time but you know we had to be mindful that we have to catch the train not the train but like i guess the bus to come back uh to the hotel and make sure you know we're like we're there we're not freaking you know, you know fooling around and then we like god knows like we, we don't have no idea what the hell we're at right so yeah uh, this is definitely well, for sure like a better oh, oh, How much damage is gonna do to it? 500k probably Dude, oh my god, we're slowly reaching to the point where we're gonna freaking die by a freaking super attack But yeah, um hotel is closer by to the convention center So that's super helpful too. So in case like whatever we get buy some stuff and we're like tired of carrying it around We could just always go back to the hotel drop it off and then boom go back to the convention and kick it right off again and yeah, dude, it's just I, I I have a feeling this packs might be a better pack than what I did last year, dude. I, I I don't know. I just got a feeling, dude. Um, only one way to find out, right? If it's gonna be a better packs by um by spending time at the you know at the place, which is literally at the time of recording this is next week. I mean, next week is on the Tuesday, which I think will I'll be doing obviously the Halo Infinite Week Rosie Challenge video, and I have to rush, 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 doing that. And then I have to do the, uh, I guess, weekly ultimate, the, the weekly ultimate challenge, obviously, but the weekly uh, video too for Halo Infinite. So I got to be recording that. I just got to have uh, videos pre-recorded for you guys. Well, I think I also, oh, no, I don't. I was going to say, do I have any, anything I could like record while like going to PAX East? But I, I honestly don't, dude. Like, <laughs> dude, there was another thing that happened too. Like the video capture card that I bought last year worked perfectly fine when we were going to PAX East uh, that year. And then whenever uh, I think I tried to like you know be prepared ahead of time to you know get the capture card ready and see if everything's working perfectly fine. But dude, the freaking Genki capture card—I think that's what it's called—doesn't um, work uh, at all for whatever uh, reason. I even contacted support see if they could help me out with the warranty one because I'm pretty sure I think it was like a year of warranty, and I think literally by now like it expired already. But dude, it stopped working. I'm like, dude, what the freaking hell, dude? <laughs> and I, I gotta try out the one that my friend gave me that he bought like pretty cheaply, which I. I might honestly buy that if it works but yeah i was so pissed off dude like the like i guess i don't i already an official like brand genki but I, I thought they were and i like i submitted i think i don't know if it was a form or i had to email the the support team but i email like i did what i could to try to get a freaking what's gonna call it uh i guess like a replacement for my uh capture card and i never got a response back and i was like so upset i'm like dude are you freaking kidding me dude and i was kind of like a bit worried at first because i like dude I definitely want to capture like some videos here and there because I did that last year, honestly. But uh, I think the videos came out like a little crappy. <laughs> but um, yeah, I did that last year, and then uh, you know it still worked, right? And then I'm like, dude, I need like a capture card here. But thankfully, like I said, my friend he let me borrow his uh, capture card that he bought cheaply on Amazon, which I forgot what it was called. But it works perfectly fine. I'll definitely uh, be buying that for sure. Not Genki again, dude. I'm pissed off that they still did that to me, but whatever. Um, but yeah. Uh, got, ooh, I'm wondering how much this is gonna do to us. Probably like 300k, I'm going to assume, because we're almost guarding. And she did get a few key spheres to um, reduce him. Oh, not okay. 150k, not too bad. I'll take that. But yeah, 
um that's about it for my pack uh trip uh you know that's what we have planned hopefully like i said this year i feel like it will be a much better year than it was last year for sure dude it's gonna be fun dude i wonder what kind of stories are gonna bring uh bring back because i remember last year uh i i'm, I, I'm pretty sure i talked about it in a dokkan all Stars video where i freaking got free food and free stuff when uh, it, it was funny dude it was funny and then uh there was some other there was like some other stories too that uh came up within um you know during our trip but yeah uh that <laughs> let's let's see what other stories are gonna come uh, i'm gonna come back with oh too even though i'm not a good storyteller myself which i kind of hate i still have to like improve on that but within time i guess right within time but anyways guys that's gonna do for me guys Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace out everyone.